a brand new you and all store was going to be opening up in all places grafton they don't just do dresses they do things like tops and jumpers cardigans jeans so don't you fret we will be getting a bunch of trying on today twenty dollars i'm shook it shook it that is a bargain and a half but this set was $30. You guys ask me all the time, where's an affordable plus size boutique? You and all. <laughs> Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Today is so freaking exciting. I found out a couple of weeks ago that a brand new you and all store was going to be opening up in all places Grafton, New South Wales. And for those of you that have been following along my journey, I've recently moved down to Northern New South Wales Rivers region, um, Northern Rivers region, and I'm right near Grafton. So I reached out to you and all and I asked if I could go and check out their latest store and bring you guys along with me and they have agreed. So I'm so excited to partner up with you and all today and share with you what's in store because for so long <laughs> plus size girls have only been able to shop online and now Oh, I should mention that if you don't know, You and All is the sister company of Ali. And for many years growing up, I went and shopped in Ali. And I can no longer do that because of my size. And I feel like the options for plus size women is so minimal to go into store and try on things. But I'm here to tell you, I'm here to let you know that from now, as you are watching this, you can go to Grafton and check out the products in person and try them on and get your shopping on. So today we are going to do a shop with me in you and all and I'm so freaking excited. Ah! <laughs> if you guys are just as excited, please go down, hit the thumbs up, leave me some comments along the way of your favorite pieces that I show. I'll also be showing my favorite items when we get home, pieces that I might pick up in store. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I create plus size clothing hauls and shop with me's and all of that kind of fun content. So if you like that and that's up your alley, please subscribe and yeah, let's get shopping. This is to die for, tie dye for. It is this gorgeous blue tie dye. It is only $25.99 for the top, which is extremely affordable. I will do a bunch of trying on in a minute, but I kind of want to just scout the store, see what we find. It is a gigantic store, given the location. Um, it also curves around that corner. Um, we have a mixture of things in here. That's what I love about you and all is they not they don't just do dresses. They do things like tops and jumpers, cardigans, jeans. So don't you fret. We will be getting a bunch of trying on today, seeing a variety of what they have to offer. Oh my god. Look at this teddy jacket. So freaking soft. <clears throat> Your girl's gonna go broke. Oh, also love this corduroy jacket. That is so chic. <gasps> Love it. This colour is so trendy right now. The burnt orange slash rusty colour. So chic. It's also like a thick linen-y cottage... What's it called? Cheesecloth, not cottage. <laughs> Cheesecloth material. This beautiful detailing. Love that. This oatmeal linen top is so gorgeous. Pair that with that skirt and you have yourself a look. Oh my god, they have more tie-dye. <gasps> that 
that is so cute wow I saw this online on the Instagram it is this gorgeous checker skirt very school like but I'm obsessed oh my god <laughs> my god it comes in blue we're trying that on Stop it. Look at those overalls. I am so freaking obsessed. They're called the Plus, oh, you can't even see me. They're called the Plus Denim Overalls in denim blue. Doesn't have the price on it though, but sometimes you just gotta take the risk, you know? That is so chic, so cute. And it's going in my basket to try on. Oh, 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 oh I'm spotting some things up here take a look at how cute that print is I will never get sick of animal print I don't care what you say it is trendy <laughs> something I always struggle to find and buy is shorts for plus size women this looks like the perfect mum style with the loose bottom and I'm not too sure about the top whether it's stretchy or not but that'll be interesting to try on they have a pair of the short overalls oh my goodness life made so chic. Oh, we have some jumper dresses. Wow. And it's really nice material as well. Good quality. Oh, stop it. This is stunning. Oh my goodness. It's like a mixture between a red and a burnt orange rust. It looks more red on camera than it is in person, but that is stunning. Need. Okay, another need so soft so cute it's actually a cropped version of a, a jumper that i got last year or the year before but i love that trends evolve and become more trendy hence the word trend katie good job another new arrival and this one has a really interesting bust line it's kind of got that corset style which i'm not sure how it's going to go on a plus size set of boobs if you're watching this then you're likely going to be plus size and have experienced the same kind of things that I have with corsets. I find that they kind of squish the boobs down, make them pancakes. Um, and this whole new trend that's coming out with corsets has really scared me off because a lot of the time, like I said, it's unflattering. So I'm interested to try this on and give you guys an idea for how they have custom designed pieces for plus size girls because obviously it's a plus size store. Um, and it's a style that I'm not used to seeing, so I'm excited. Okay, so this is the first outfit, super duper cute. I've ended up wearing the size 22 in this. It is a little big because they don't currently have the 20 in stock um, and the 18 was slightly too small around my hips. So definitely the size 20, size up one size. Um, and then this shirt is a ribbed. So this shirt's quite long as you can see and I've just tucked it into the skirt. Um, it's got these gorgeous little tortoise shell buttons. And I'd probably undo the top button if it was everyday wear, um, just like that, a bit more casual. And the sleeve length is really nice. It's such a cute pairing. I might even tie it in a knot rather than tucking it in. Gives it a little bit more of a schoolgirl vibe. Very, very chic. Okay, this is outfit number two. I'm so obsessed, you guys, with this overalls. The only thing I will say is I will probably go up a size. So I'm wearing the 18 currently, which fits me perfectly like a glove but as you guys know I hold a lot of weight in my tummy and so for me personally 
For comfort levels with overalls, I much prefer a baggier style, so I'll probably go up to the 20, um, at least trying that on. But it is literally fitting like a glove, and these buttons on the side are perfect to get in and out of the um, suit as well. It has a slit at the knee, which you can see, and they have the um, mannequin rolled up on the bottom, but these are perfect. Unrolled, I think. They come just below the ankle. Honestly, so chic. And then this shirt, can we just talk about it? It's so cute, it's got a little sunflower. This is a new in piece and I'm obsessed with it, this whole outfit, tick of approval. Okay, next up we have the smock dress in rust. I'm wearing the size 18 and I think this is a really good size for me. Um, I love the high neckline. I think that's a real point of difference to a lot of other dresses that I have. Um, and also the three quarter length puffy sleeve. So it's not puff at the top, very slimline and then it goes to this two-tiered puff sleeve it's so chic so cute um, it's also a really fabulously modest length for the type of dress that it is um, it comes right down to the knee I'm just so freaking obsessed and I also think this will be perfect for pregnancy even though it's technically not a pregnancy dress it has so much room in there Oh, giving plus size women so many more options and I'm so excited about it. Okay, so I've chucked back on the ribbed t-shirt from earlier and I've, I'm just obsessed. I'm just obsessed. I've paired it with this faux skirt. It is like a caramel color. Um, I have it in the size 18 and it is called the faux leather skirt. Um, it is the perfect length. Like, look at that. And I just noticed it has a slit. Excuse me. It's so freaking chic and cute. And I was just talking to Brooke, who's one of the girls that work here, um, about how, as plus size women, we've had so many years of just florals, and now brands are bringing out things like this that are chic AF, or chic AF in my, my books. Um, and it allows us to layer and create those same outfits that straight sizes have, but in a plus size way. And I'm so freaking excited about it. I've just tied this up through one of the loops of the buttons um, and I really like it. I've also tucked it in at the back. This skirt is coming home with us. Okay, next up is this gorgeous blue tie-dye set. I showed you it earlier in the store and I just had to try it on because I mean, look at it. Stunning, like honestly. It is so nicely oversized that you can either wear it down or you could do what I was doing and tuck it in. Um, I just think it is the perfect tie dye set. There was a couple out there. Um, I think there was a black and this, and then there was also the multicolor. I don't know if the multicolor comes as a set or if it's just the t-shirt, but um, can we just soak this in because it is divine and I am literally taking this home and no one can stop me. <laughs> Okay, so we have the final dress on, which is this beautiful corset design that we were talking about earlier. Please excuse <laughs> my bra, but you've got to envision this with a push-up bra. I think this is a game changer. So unique. I've not ever seen a dress like this, like I was saying out there, that has the corset design for bustier women. I'm just speechless. Absolutely love it. I also really like that the... Um, sleeve design can go up over the shoulders or it can be off the shoulder so it's really just whatever you want it to be and it's also not loose it's very as you can see tight and springy so we're not going to have any slipping off the shoulder problems the only one flaw with it that i will say um, and this could just be a possible thing on my body is where the placement of the strap is is right under the breast so it's kind of hiding um, it almost needs to come down to my waistline which is just here um, but that's a really minor issue I'll just take that off and pop a proper belt on um, and it's also got the tear design too which I forgot to mention and double layer so obsessed with it 100% taking this home final dress I just have to share this is so cute obsessed with this print and also the shape and cut very vintage style um, it has this gorgeous gold um, detailings if you can see <laughs> it's not going to show it there but as you can see it's got this gorgeous brassy gold detail um, 
thing I think I'm most in love with is just this little frill that goes all the way around. It is so chic, so cute. The only thing I will say is um, I would upsize to the next size. This is an 18, um, but if I was to buy it, I would buy the 20 purely because the line that this is stitched on is pulling into my arm a little bit, ever so slightly. But again, I hold a lot of weight in my arms and not all plus size women do, so it is hard for brands to cater to every size um, or slash style of shape. Um, but I just have to take my hats off to them. Today's haul has been incredible. Just got done in the changing rooms and Brooke was telling me that, um, and this is something I had to let you guys know about, um, that the dungarees that I tried on all the overalls, um, there is a short version, which I showed you before, but these are on clearance for 20 dollars currently twenty dollars i don't know if that's just in this store or if it's online as well but i highly recommend that you go and check them out i am now all done in store i think we should go home and i'll show you what pieces i picked up okay i just got home from you and all and i just have to say the staff there was so incredibly friendly and lovely which of course is to be expected but not always received in other stores so i just have to first of all say that the girls there were just so lovely so if you are a local or you're passing through or you're going to Coffs or Sydney from Brisbane or whatever please make a detour into the store to visit the girls there they're so lovely um, and I thought that I would share with you the pieces that I brought home so I ended up getting a few pieces because <laughs> Not that you guys know this, you know I don't need any more clothes, <laughs> but there is certain gaps to my wardrobe which I would like filled. But also, you can't surpass a good deal. And there are some good deals to be had there. All up, I spent $178.10, which was a bargain given what I actually picked up. So I ended up buying the overalls, which you guys saw were a bloody classic. I have, it has taken me years, absolutely years, to find something like this. The wide leg, super nice oversized overalls. And I ended up sizing up to the 20 just for that pouch area like I was saying, but I am an apple size lady. I hold my weight in my tummy. Some women hold it in their hips or thighs. Um, and so just depending on how you hold your weight, um, you may want to take that into consideration. But the legs were so roomy. I just am freaking obsessed with these. So if you wanted to get your hands on these, these are called the Plus Denim Overall Denim Blue, size 20, and they were $59.99, which can I say is just incredibly priced given the quality of these. You guys saw the tie-dye on me and I could not go past it. It was just a cute set that's going to definitely be worn through winter. I was going to say it would be a good all year round item, which is so true, but it's such a thick jersey material. Like I can't really explain it um, other than that, just trusting me that it's quite thick. So I think that this will actually keep me quite nice and warm in winter. Obviously maybe a jumper over it as well. And then the shirt was so oversized, which was a nice surprise because normally these kind of things are really tight. I think I got them in a size 20 though. Oh no, I did get them in a size 18. Wow, okay. That's a nice surprise. So there was actually a few things um, on sale in the store. So on the tag, it said that they were $25.99. But on my um, receipt, and she said that they have like sales throughout the store. So on the receipt, they're coming in at $15.99 each, which means that this set was $30. You guys ask me all the time, where's an affordable plus size boutique? You and all. <laughs> oh my God, I'm so excited to put those on my body. I couldn't go past, sorry, this is rustling, but I'm trying to keep it close by to reference the prices for you guys. This faux skirt, obviously is all crinkled now that we've popped it in a bag, but can I just say, feels incredibly luxy. Um, it is double lined because it's got the um, cotton inlay and it is called the plus faux leather skirt in tan color size 18 now this didn't have a price in it because the store is still currently um obviously quite new they're getting all the price price tags on the stickers on the stickers on the tags get your words out katie um so that particular item was only 19.99 
$20. I'm shooketh. Shooketh. That is a bargain and a half. I mean, you guys would have seen the little slit on me and like on the side of the skirt. It's just, it is one of those items that plus size girls have just never been able to get their hands on. I feel like for so many years, all we had access to was floral and baggy things. And now they're finally cottoning on that we don't want that necessarily. Sometimes we do, but sometimes we also want to wear what straight size women wear, but in plus size to fit our bodies. And so that right there is one of those items that I just couldn't go past because of the fact that it's going to be a staple in my wardrobe. And then the very last item that I picked up and I talked about it because it was so unique was this beautiful dress. And I purely bought it because of the neckline. Um, I just think, honestly, that corset style, you're not going to come past that again. Or so I keep telling myself. Um, I'm not going to see that kind of thing again. Maybe in the future, but it's not common right now. Um, and so for that reason, I thought I'm going to get that. That is a really nice classic item. And this one was actually the most expensive thing in the haul, coming in at $65.99. Otherwise, everything else was on clearance except for the denim overalls. Um, everything else was on sale. So I am so shocked. And maybe that isn't the sale price. Maybe the $19.99 for the skirt is its full price. I'm not too sure. But all I can say is, overall, my experience today has just filled me with so much joy. And I know that this was in partnership with you and all. So, you know, know that. But also, you guys know that I give honest reviews. And to be honest with you, I haven't had such a positive experience in store since I was in my teenage years because I haven't been able to access stores. There's a couple of brands that we all know who they are, we can obviously go into them, but now we have another option and I feel that this is a very accessible option. It's not out of budget, it is also kind of your everyday wear, not just your formal wear, and I just think they've hit the nail on the head and I'm so excited that we have a store in Grafton to access. Like what? Grafton of all places. Okay, that is it from me, you guys. I hope you enjoyed today's haul and shop with me. If you did, I would love it if you went down and hit the thumbs up coming into the comments as well and telling me what your favorite piece was from the haul. What should I have got that I maybe didn't? Um, and yeah, I'll see you really soon for another video. Bye guys.